Today's society lacks the acceptance of entrepreneurs. Society have different perspective towards entrepreneurs and employees. I'll just clear this context. Let us take an example of a person who achieved or who scored a good job with a, a very good package and etc. And let us consider he is in a function where he is surrounded with his family, his relatives, friends, etc. And if he present that, okay, I got a job, this is my package, this is what I'm going to do, etc. We know, right, a lot of people around we is going to encourage him, right, because he, he scored a very good job. That's a very great thing. And it's, it's obviously that's a very good uh, kind of sign we get from society. Employers are getting the kind of acceptance. Real good. But when it comes to the entrepreneur's case, for example, if a person the same way comes with a business idea that he is going to pursue about, what would be the kind of acceptance or what would be the kind of uh, perspective that this kind of society is going to have on him? Obviously, the relatives, the friends and all, uh, all the people surrounded by him is going to criticize him for what he is doing. Everybody will be happy, like asking like, oh, why you would be choosing this entrepreneurship? You can go for a job, right? That would be pretty good, right? And is there any assurance that your business is going to work out or what? Etc. A lot of questions. Obviously, that will be a negative aspect when it comes to a mindset of entrepreneur. When it comes to an employee and entrepreneur, before that, I'm not here to tell you that this is good, that is bad, etc. Both entrepreneurship and employment is literally needed in this country for the development. But when it comes to employment, it requires the skill and time of a person. But when it comes to entrepreneurship, it requires a lot. It includes the skill, it, it needs a time, it needs a lot of energy, it needs a lot of passion. It needs a lot of mental health and a lot more because an entrepreneur is a person who is dealing with a lot of stress within his head, right? But the kind of acceptance that the entrepreneurship should be getting is completely underrated here. People like entrepreneurs are completely underrated here, right? <clears throat> most probably, most of the entrepreneurs will be ready for this kind of mindset. Like, I don't care anybody. Let them tell whatever they need. I will be following my passion. That would be the kind of mindset that an entrepreneur would be having most of the time. But still, this kind of talks gives negative aspect on an entrepreneur's mind. You know, right, it is all about an ecosystem, right? If at all he is uh, working in a place where he have a lot of support from family, he have a lot of support from relatives, friends, etc. He can flourish much faster. In the same way, he is not in such kind of uh, ecosystem, which means that it would be pretty more uh, like he has to push forward right he has to push himself more forward in order to be in such a community and then moving forward with this entrepreneurship so basically you know right entrepreneurship is something that requires a lot of skill lot of energy and it gives a job for a lot of people and it gives it like basically in our country entrepreneurship does something remarkable right if like uh, if at all you're thinking about a time where entrepreneurship is not of that much as of now you could remember right very few companies very few jobs unemployment at its peak right now you know right almost 70 percentage of the employment rates of india has been fulfilled by entrepreneurs small scale entrepreneurs okay so in this case entrepreneurs requires more acceptance from society people has to be recognized this 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 kind of people are here for a sake of their passion, they are doing something remarkable for the country, remarkable for the people. Most probably, if they flourish, they has to be like they will be providing you with a lot of job opportunities, a lot of other aspects. So the whole point is this: entrepreneurs should be getting the right acceptance that he or she should be getting. And another kind of perspective that we see in our society is this. Uh, criticizing the product you know right for an entrepreneur be it a service or a product based entrepreneur he'll be having a product which he put his heart and soul into right taking suggestions or giving suggestions is really good but criticizing is a very bad aspect when it comes to the way that you speak we have a com community of entrepreneurs and we've been speaking about this topic that when we present a topic or when we present a product or service to a common people or to society the first question would be this, like, would you, would you think that this is going to work out? That would be the first question. Do you think that these things are going to work out? Why are you buying, like, why are you are pull, pulling out a lot of money from people for this product? Uh, what, what kind of use does this product give you? A lot of questions, like, even though that product brings a lot of value into a person, you get to have hearing that kind of criticism from a lot of people, right? 
because you know right there is a part of society which will be benefited from this kind of product but you have to hear the criticism from another part of society as well as them as well so this all of these come under the initial stages of a business right but this the, the whole point completely turns over when the business becomes successful become become it becomes much popular right you know right whenever a business is so much of popular we have so much of popularity and people start to recognize it and etc then people start to think about like that's a great job man like the same people who criticized him will be telling for the same product that okay you did a great job for the country you've been doing a great job you gave job for a lot of people you have a brave mindset so that is how society see people that is how society see the products that entrepreneurs build so the two aspects or two things that i have to convey through this video is first for the entrepreneurs if at all you are a person who is building a product or who is working on a product or why you like if at all you are an entrepreneur be strong and be steady because once your products start to get recognized once your products start to get have a global in or in national attention it will be recognized and people start to speak good about you so there is no point in thinking what people are thinking about you or no point in asking what other people are going to uh, think about your talk about you so that's no point in doing that and the next thing that i have to talk about is to the public like you and me whenever you see an entrepreneur trying to do or something out there suggestions are great but still make sure that don't hurt a person okay the same way you have to make sure if at all that product seems to be good if at all you think that that kind of product will bring some kind of values to society don't forget to appreciate the person and also if that product does not fit your niche never give an advice to him okay because know what to speak so from now when you come across an entrepreneur or when you come across a person who's building something for himself and the society try to appreciate him and try to give that kind of acceptance that you give for an employee thank you